taking your herd out to pasture, surviving the conditions of the desert, living on your land and feeling constantly threatened. Looking around watchfully, suspecting any noise from a distance, knowing that they could appear at any minute, those in uniform or those in tassels. Escape. You cannot be here. Why? Because it's a military area. It's a firing zone. This land belongs to the farm. Because you are a threat. Where should we go? There. Where is there? There. There. But there, they have already dug a ditch to prevent your herd from reaching the pasture. There they launch a drone above the sheep to cause them to panic and run. There soldiers race their vehicles into the herd because they think it's funny, because they feel like it, because they're in control and those who are in control can do what they like. If they feel like it, they will uproot your olive trees and burn your fields. If they feel like it, they will confiscate your water sources or riddle them with bullet holes. If they feel like it, they will build a fence around the spring to prevent your cows from drinking. Because there is no one to forbid them from being cruel to you, and no one to protect you from those who believe they are God's chosen ones, and that through their evil deeds of theft and apprehension, they will reach salvation. And you are asked to contain your rage and lower your gaze. And if you dare rebel against those who control you, they will arrest you brutally. If you stand for your right for a life of dignity, they may shoot you. They will not let you forget for a moment. They will barge into your tents by day, using dogs and guns to beat and scare you. They will surprise you at night, waking you rudely from sleep to tell you you cannot graze your herd there. Where should we go? There. Coming back from the pasture, giving the sheep water, riding your bike, and knowing it could happen at any minute. The noise of the military cars and trucks coming to your tents to destroy them, to confiscate your belongings, leaving you exposed to the terrible heat, humiliated and defeated in front of your children, without food or water, not knowing where and when you will go. Little boy, you've seen your parents scared and helpless, as those who fight for the security of Israel took your bike away to throw it on one of the mountains, far out of your reach, and you watched them as they did it, without a trace of compassion or shame. Their eyes passed over you, listening to their commander as he shouted, get them out of here. Look at them, child. Soon they will take off their uniforms and travel the world. They will study medicine or law or maybe the history of the Jewish people. And you will continue to wander the desert with your sheep, submissive and threatened. Because this is your life and the life of your family in this wild region of the Jordan Valley where no law can protect you nor can any human emotion.